Welcome back to the channel and thank you for joining me in another episode in the Talos Principle 2. Guys, this will be episode 6, by the way, we are in the third world. Um, made a few puzzles, we made those two, 7, 8, now we are trying to make 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And let's see what is that one going to give us. This one is called Inversion. Um, inversion, inverter. So open that one first because we got another one in there. Boop. Take anything else in here. Nope. Okay. Don't need that way. Let's open this guy. Let's grab this guy. Uh, we need the red in here. So the blue is around the corner, right? Well, in that case, you how to stay in here, mister. Let's grab the blue from that guy. Put it in here for the red. Anything in the back? No? Mm, okay. Activate. Let's go. Next, number two. Going that way. I sent the drone to have a look at one of the other puzzle clusters. It seems they remain inert until they're connected. Oh. I uploaded the pictures to the lock. Should we check them out with the VTOL? Let's conserve fuel as much as we can. There's no point in going there if it's all dead. Uh, number two, it's in here. Nice puzzle you have in here, Mrs. So, you remember we didn't do um, one of the puzzles and the other side it was a sphinx with 2478 right, right I went in there between episodes and behind each plate on each number so one through eight you have a switch in the back so my guess is we gotta get in there and switch two four seven eight and that thing will be active we're gonna check it out at what we finish with the this one here energy maintenance oh this is a normal connector well, hello there. Okay. Let's put it like that. Maybe we're gonna need that one. I've got a feeling we will. Oh! Oh! This is pretty interesting here. Um, so in here we need the red and the blue. Wow. That means one of these boys got a stain here. And they gotta bring the other one. But um, red, and I need the blue in there. So I need to bring the blue. I can bring the blue with two of these guys. I can bring the blue with that guy as well. But I will cross the lines. So. We need that boy in here. <clears throat> Issue is that this one needs red. So we'll take that red connected to this red. We'll steal that boy. We'll grab this red and make it blue in here. Amazing! Genius! Number two is done. Let's go. Can barely wait to see who we're gonna spoke with. Hi there. You wanna talk? What did you find? A coin? Yeah, good. I can't stop thinking about Miranda. Yeah, me too. A new person not born in New Jerusalem. Can you imagine that? Amazing, isn't it? I wonder what it's it? like to be her. Uh, I don't know. Lonely, yeah. Uh, maybe, probably not. Depends on who created her. Nah. Lonely, yeah. Maybe she's more free than we are. Lonely, we'll go lonely. I suppose that depends on how many other people were here, but... You might be right. This place is huge, but it it feels empty. It is, isn't it? Let me ask you something else. What do you make of these labs? They're very different from the rest of these structures in that they serve a clear purpose. Everything else is kind of surreal. Yep. But the labs are places where people lived and worked. I don't know what that means, but I think it means something. Uh, towers. Maybe they're for powering up the mega structure, or maybe they just open it like keys. Why? 
No idea. But aren't they gorgeous? Do you, Just yeah, incredible yeah, feats no, of engineering. Amazing. Let's go. I agree. Uh, yep, they're beautiful. I don't know who built this place, but whoever they were, they must have had a purpose. Making something so beautiful feels like a statement of intent. Indeed. But by now, we have work to do. Number three, coming up. Uh, I got a bunch of question marks on my party today. For example, one in here. I tried to stay on the path, BAJ. I'm passing by a, a question mark in here. How can I stay on the path? Oh, we're just... Uh, it, it guides us, okay? Honing! Hypatia. 42. Permanent structures. Who written this? Hypatia. Okay, message fragment. Miranda. Yep. Mm-hmm. Not gonna read that. Let's go. Don't have much time to record today. Number three. There and back again. So we need an uh yeah. Mm-hmm. Only there. So this one will turn into a red in here. So I need to keep this one open. And then bring everything behind? How do I get this one open? I used to be there. That one didn't work. Uh, no. Because this one was interrupted. So, in order to make it work, we gotta connect that boy in here. Uh, yeah. That one just happened. So, let's put this one in here. Out of the way. So that those beams do not cross. Well, I think we could use it more in the back in here. Maybe we'll need to connect to that. Two connections. Go in there. It's done. Grab my my toy from here. Uh, well, we'll need that for sure. So we have the blue in here. Well, I think we can safely connect it to that one as well, just to have the gate open. I don't know if we're gonna need set gate, but it is what it is. So, that's blue. We need to make it ready here. We need to grab that one, Jiggy, which transforms the power. Bring it back. Uh -huh. Um, That one needs two connections. We need to grab this one, Jiggy. Sorry, pass intro. Red, red. Uh, we don't have blue in here. Um, I'll be locked out, isn't it? So this one transforms it. Well, if it transforms it, um, I need to connect this one with that one in here, like. Grab this. Go the other way. Connect the red to the red in here. Grab my Majigi, come in here. Uh, okay, so we will need the red. And the blue. And guess what? Red and blue equals green. Shoot! Red and blue equals green. Uh, one extra. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Let's 
Is there a connection on there? Hmm, hard to say. Okay, let's put it here. Keep on going. Uh, we made number three. We go for number four in here. Hi there. Good thing you don't want to talk. Who are you? Alcatraz. Number four down the line in here. Refraction. Um. Okay. We got two of those in there. We got a blue in here, so we can make it a red. Okay. We can grab this. Uh, cannot pass with it that way. So I can make it the blue again. And then we can take that blue and make it red. But wait, 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 it's not good. That ain't good, mister. I need red in there. So let's connect this one here. Just to be connected. Um, so this one is red. I will make it blue. Oh. We can grab some pretty flowers from here. Well, blue. So, connect it to red. Okay, so. I need that red. Uh, let's come, like, here. Con connect it with that mid blue. Then we'll connect it to this, just to open the gate. When I'm gonna pick this one up, it's gonna sustain itself. That blue in there is gonna turn red in here. And we're gonna take the red in here and make it blue in here. Um, good or what? Mm -hmm. Let's go. Jumping like a monkey. Jumping like a monkey. Another people. People. Yeah, good. Okay. Five. Why isn't it blinking? It's showing me the gate blinking. Why is the gate blinking? Let's go to number five. We're gonna check that gate afterwards. Um, where to, mister? Uh, this, I feel like we already solved it in the last one. And we grabbed that. Yeah, we did, we did, we did. We're fine, we get, we can go. We can move on with our lives. Let's go to number five. Where? Uh, five is that away. Uh, amazing. Well, then what's in here? Have we been through here? Yeah, we've been. It's a lost puzzle. Okay. Good stuff. Number five coming up. Gotta make them all. They will be mine. This is beautiful. Anybody has a fishing rod? It's tough in the water. Like branches. Okay, number five. What is this? Beautiful structure over there. Number five. Weep! Imprisoned. Not imprisoned. Uh, we gotta make it in there somehow. Uh, I see that, but how do you connect to that? Through that? I don't think it works. Maybe it does. So, this is an inverter. Uh, when we're gonna twist on this, that one will open, I believe. Yep, there. So, really interesting. Um, this one doesn't have a connection. Believe it or not. Okay. So, in here we needed the blue. Uh, can I connect this one just like that? Like that? Maybe here? Well, apparently it does work. So we're gonna need that one connected to that one to make red. But we're gonna need to 
take that one and connect it to that one. I mean, that one doesn't work. Okay, so. Um. That is gonna be a pretty interesting adventure. So, that red will make blue in there, and we'll make blue in here as well. As long as we put it in a appropriate place. In there. You know what? Do that. I need to connect that. Shit. So we need to open this one first. Uh, blue. Because the other one is red. Oh, it's blue. Oh, in that case, you come with me here. Um, you stand there. Ah, I see. It's gonna intersect the line. The lines. Okay, let's take that blue and connect it in there. So, as soon as I turn this one on, that one will be open. But so even if I pass with that inverter to here, it doesn't help me because I cannot connect to anything from this side. Nevertheless, I could. No, I cannot connect through this one unless that one is open and stuff. In order for that one to be open and stop, we need to make it in here blue. You can come with me in that case. Uh, sorry? Wait, wait, why not? Didn't I put you in there? No, sorry. Blue with blue. Uh, that one turns into red, believe it or not. Yeah, but the issue is that I will cross the lines, you see? I mean, okay, that one it's open. Okay, let's see it's open. Uh, this one, when I connect it to the red to give me blue, it will cross this line, I think. So I will need that one to be open and that one to be open. And apparently I can grab them all in this corner like in here. Yeah. What? See? That's what's going on in there. And I stop. So. I need to keep that one open and stop. I would like to be inside there right now, but I am not. Okay, so if that one is not, well, let's try and put it in here. I think this is the way to do it, mister. Yep. Come here. Give me that blue. We are free! Get into Camelania. Perfect, we made number five. We get the beautiful music. Let's go to number six. Apparently, it's the last one here. Then we gotta check that gate because it's blinking and it says enter the tower. Oh, that's the gate. Yeah, mm, okay. We're gonna go in there, mister. Number six hidden. What's hidden? Oh, we can just circle it around like that. Um, so, in order to open this boy, we need the blue and the red. That is blue. Um, 
Wait, what? What is this thing? Well, can't I just grab that one and the other one and put them in there? Oh, it's only one. It is only one, mister. But. Yeah, can I grab that one from here? Uh, and if I put it in here, it doesn't connect through this, does it? Of course not. So I can open it, but it serves us nothing, because it cannot pass with this. I fully understand now, mister. Okay. So we're gonna need to take that blue and turn it red, but in here. And uh, now that one is kind of open, but why is that blue in there? Because I don't get it, you know? Like, why is that blue in here? What, what does it do? Why? Why would it be in here? I mean, what purpose do you serve? Why do we exist? It doesn't connect through that. Okay, so what did I achieve? I opened it. How does that one help me? Oh, I know how that one helps me. Uh, that one... Actually... Will allow me to connect through that. Through that. And through that. Leave that door open even without this boy. And now I can take the blue and put it in here. What? What will that achieve? Okay, I have two of you now. What? Why do I need that? I'm still unable to take it in there. Why would I need this in my life? Oh, I know. I know. Stupid. Okay. Because I need the blue in this side. Because if that one is open, the blue, I can put it in here. Basically, I pass through the gate. And I can bring it in here like this. And open this game. Or even better, do it like that. Uh, or even better, do it like that. Uh, sorry, beautiful face, nevertheless. <laughs> Welcome to the channel. This bitch, every all the stupid jokes are here. Yeah, it's, it doesn't connect to that one. <laughs> Who put this tree in here? I resetted the connection anyway. So now this is open, and guess what? Because that one is so sustained by the blue which turns into red, I can steal this one and come with it in here, and put it in here, and come back, and take that, put it in here. So what's the hidden stuff, Majiga? What's hidden, basically? What, what, do we have a secret secret in here? What's hidden? Huh? I see a lake. Let's get out of here. So, we need to get to the gate. Um, let's go to the gate. I see a question mark on my HUD. We'll go in there because we haven't made it in here. Uh, yeah, it's right in here. 
Oh, Every site we've investigated has had one of these labs. Another one but of these. they seem primitive compared to some of the technology we're seeing above ground. Are we even sure that the labs and the puzzles belong to the same people? There seems to be a connection between the experimental setups in the labs and some of the puzzle technology. Correlation does not necessarily imply causation, though. True. But just because we don't understand the connection, that doesn't mean it's not there. Uh, what really? we have here is two things that reflect each other. We just don't understand how that reflection works or what causes it. Maybe Miranda can tell us. Sid. He, she. So, oh, it activated. Uh, I think we've been in here, but that door was locked. What is that noise? What the fuck is going on? Anti-gravity? It's changing the gravity. So it's in here, in there, up there. Up there. Amazing. Uh, I wanna take a look at this. Those look like... Planets. Or atoms. They're atoms. But what are those? Maybe they're planets? I don't know, let's uh, see what's in here. Connecting! The end draft. Olofemi Canada. Grodna 1. So Miranda commented on this. Fail to low profile. I need it once. Fail to low profile. Fail to low comment. So somebody else came. That's very interesting. Lord Don Sani Chan. Name of project. C353. Uh, 3553. Okay, let's go. Uh, so, we gotta enter the tower. And we gotta keep an eye out for any question marks. Uh, question marks uh, up here. I'm looking. Oh my god, a lot of stuff. Um, yeah, go ahead, dodge the devil, you know. This is really interesting. So each time I'm pushing tab to show you what I'm looking for, uh, I found new stuff. <laughs> sorry about that, guys. I'm really sorry about that. Uh, where is that gate? Let's find the gate. Power gate. That way. Okay. Let's go. We made this one happen. 
Oh, it's so beautiful in here, it's so stunning. Uh, what is this place? Have we been in here? Number 8, we've been. Uh, gate to the left. Okay. We see the gate in here. Finally made it to the game. Where is that other gate? The one that didn't open. In here? Down here it was? Somewhere? Uh, this gate, you know? Like this gate? I feel it was somewhere in here. No, missed it. I don't want to go all the way up there, mister. This one. So we didn't even make half of the first one. What do you think about this? Oh my god. Okay. Let's take care of this puzzle in here. I need to walk on this basically. Is that what you're telling me? I think I need to fill this guy up. Oh, this is really interesting, mister. Me likes it. Oh, it's just amazing. What is expected then? Yeah? about to go into this huge star whatever it is the music just went nice drums in it. Let's just call it here we go I can see my my toes who's gonna be with us man? all the sphinx you're so when the beautiful when Daedalus was imprisoned in the very labyrinth he had created his only solace was his son, Icarus. I know the story. To escape their plight, he fashioned wings of feathers and wax. He warned his son to fly neither too high nor too low. But his son, enraptured by the freedom of flight, flew too close to the sun. Thus the wax in his wings melted, and he fell to his death. Yep. What was the son's error? Mm. Wow. Hmm. Whoa. <laughs> this was a uh, this yeah whatever. I wouldn't go that far. This one. Yes. Uh, but this one is the most important one. Yet many great feats came of rebellion and disobedience. You yourself are born of that lineage. Uh, you sure? After the death of his son, Daedalus withdrew in sorrow to a foreign land. King Minos came looking for the craftsman to exact his revenge. The answer to a riddle revealed where Daedalus dwelled. But for Minos, that answer was his ruin. Consider King Minos burned in his bath as you seek your own answer. How is that one connected? With this stuff. In here, my jiggies. Kameha Meha! The megastructure, it's opening. Oh, really? Three receivers, three towers, three beams, as we suspected. I think this is an invitation. Doesn't look that inviting to me. If you consider the size of the entire structure, then that opening must be big enough to drive a building through. Or the VTOL. 
You want us to go in there, into the creepy <laughs> triangular <laughs> maw of death. Maw of death? I think it looks charming. <laughs> to quote 1K, come on, Al, live a little. So. Byron's right. We're here to explore, and this is a mystery worth investigating. This technology could change everything. Oh, all right. <laughs> I'm not winning this, am I? No, you're not. We're going in there. Let's meet up with the VTOL, everybody. Yeah. We're going in. We're going in. <laughs> First, we're gonna go and meet the puzzle in level two. Told you, we've already been there. Here we are. Um, where exactly was? Uh, so we know we, we need two, four, seven, eight. Let's just keep on the tracking here, searching from number one. Then we're gonna follow that ray. There is another one. Why is there another one? There is another one. Have you seen it? Where is the that one? Where does that one end? So this is the Sphinx in here. It's at the start. You see? 2478? Well, let's just... Let's just go to 2478. We're gonna take a look at that right after. That connection. Uh, one, two. Okay. This is number one. Well, check this one out. You see? We will not turn it on because we need 2478. So... There is a connection in this, yeah? Uh, okay. We're gonna follow those. Sorry, passing through. <laughs> Come on. This is number two. Pretty curious about that other ray. It doesn't come close in here. Okay, uh, four. To the right. Oh, it comes through here. Did we activate this one? Because I cannot remember. It's in here at number three. Uh, what kind of lights do we have in here? Let's see. Back up. This one it's a driller. Uh, this one it's an exchanger converter. Well, this one it's a connector. Ooh. Blue light was in there, and I have red light here. Let's try with the red light first. Oh, uh, in there. It's not doing stuff, what you use. Okay, so it must be blue light or green light. It ain't doing shit. Okay, I feel like we've done this. But if we done it, why is it uh, not active like, you know? Whatever, we're gonna leave it like that. So, number four is next. Maybe deactivated, resetted everything? I don't know. Maybe. But this is number four. Look at this. Minutes. Yeah. Seven, eight in the gate. That way. Oh, there's a question mark in there. Gotta get up there. Sorry. This won't take long. While exploring the forest, I came across a site of primal force. A beautiful stag, standing on a hill silhouetted against the setting sun. It appeared like a messenger from some divine natural power, perhaps from Gaia herself. Even to a being such as myself, 
Less susceptible to manipulation by instincts and hormones, it was clearly a moment of revelation. In such moments, we are told to avert our eyes. But what if we do not? What will we discover if we look more closely? If we could speak to the stag, what wisdom would it have to offer? The answer is none. The stag is an animal of overwhelming stupidity, driven only by fear, hunger, and lust. There is no abyss for us to plunge into behind this revelation. Rather, the revelation is as flat and unreal as the plywood walls of a film set. Wow, that was so nice. Heading for number eight in here. Um, is that number eight? I feel like yes. Yep. So this will be the last. And it happened. Now all we gotta do is find that thing, Majiggy again. Uh, uh, no, not through here, BJ. Let's go through here. So, uh, yeah, that one came in here. The final light. So I brought it in here. Why would I need to bring it in here? Oh, I think I took it from there and connected to the other statue. Uh, which is there. And that's how we solve that thing. Yeah, you see this one, it's in here, but it didn't keep the connections. Um, yeah, exactly. Okay, so we gotta get to the Sphinx now. Okay. Well, we gotta follow that green line and we're gonna reach it. Mm. Right in here, baby. Right in here. Let's see what this unlocks for us. The wheel turns, but without the road, it cannot move. Yeah. That's so wise. Okay, let's get to number one. Get in our vital and see what is going on in there. So we just finished everything that I knew that existed. In uh, this place is in here, okay? Uh, so in here, I think, me thinks, we're in here. Travel to mega structure. No, let's get to number one because that's where the vital Let's see what's going on in there. Well, apparently no. This is only level one. Uh, that's interesting. We gotta go to the mega structure. Let us go, mega structure travel. my analysis of the particle clouds at first I thought they might be some kind of nanotechnology but I was wrong it's a lot worse than that mm -hmm. what we're looking at is a completely unknown type and state of matter completely inexplicable within our understanding of physics well created and manipulated by someone wow fascinating that's yeah so do i have a map no i hate it um uh, we have explored a little in here I mean, look how far we were that cannon those cannons are shooting through those relays oh man this this looks just a standing Come on, here people get on board we haven't got all day uh, you waited in here for me for a millennia and now you're telling Yaku, everybody to get seat. in, which aye is aye, only me and you. 
Okay, fine. Have any of you ever read an ancient writer called Ian Banks? I guess not. He postulated the concept of the outside context problem. That's when a society encounters something so advanced, so different, that they simply could not have conceived of it. That's what this is. This whole place is one giant outside context problem. And we're headed right into it. It's dark, mommy. I think I can set down over there. Should I? Please do. It's I like wait to get the a Death Star, yes sir. Setting down. Okay, everyone. We need to explore as much as we can, separately if need be, but stay in touch. Record okay. anything interesting you find, and pay special attention to any clues as to who built this place and why. Mm -hmm. The schematics we found in that lab were extremely incomplete. So if you can find any more of those, that would be great. I think someone should stay at the VTOL just in case. I volunteer you. See you later, Al. Oh man, this is so different. Um, that's not a door, by the way. Oh, look at them, they are running. I run much faster than you guys. Wow, those are moving, in case you didn't notice. There's something in there. There's something in there as well. Each one of them is taking one of the spots. Unbelievable. That one looks just amazing. Um, let's begin clockwise. So, cannot interact with Melville. She's got that one covered. Uh, Br Brian entered in here? Byron? Yes. Isn't this an incredible space? Yeah. Look at it all, it's beautiful. Uh huh. That's good, that's excellent. I find that a lot of people these days can't see the beauty in things created by human hand. They can look at an ant colony or a coral reef and be impressed, but if it was made by humans, they just don't see it. It's good to be humble as an individual, but we have to be careful not to lose track of our accomplishments as a species. If we're impressed by the complex patterns produced by animals, then this, this should be breathtaking. And there is. What you looking at exactly? How far can you see? Into that thing. What is that thing? I'm not sure I should drop in there. Let's get out of here. Okay. So Melville has the form way that this guy has uh, this, this thing. This thing seems to be broken. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, it's a plus. I just scratched my nose in here a little. Will you open? Hold on a second, Walker. Uh, what? I think I can find an override for that door. Well, you're just so Maybe after me. that, you can help me with this elevator. One problem at a time. What's going on with these file structures? Okay, door should be opening. It is gracious. About the elevator. Actually, the elevator's fine. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. No idea where I am, but it's working. Don't go too far. Try to circle back. On it. Oh, 
The pyramid inside the pyramid inside the pyramid. Yep. Mm -hmm. We are inside the Death Star. We see his bridges. I see you, bud. Wow. Please just keep on moving. Uh, we came to here. Is there another way to here? That one it's a rubber, that's for sure. Uh different. What you looking at? There's nothing in there. Okay. Found you. Boo! Hey, 1K, can we talk for a second? Yeah, what? That whole thing with the elevator just gave me the creeps. What? When we first arrived here, I was really excited. It's such a huge place. The technology is so advanced. If we figure out what it all means, we could really change the future of New Jerusalem. The mayor what? says we have to avoid repeating the mistakes our ancestors made to stay humble, to not reach too far. And that sounds very abstract, but I've seen the ancient cities. I've seen how much they built, how much they grew, how far they fell. Hmm. So I've been thinking, what if all this sets us on the same path? What if this is too much power for anyone to control? Um... This is true. 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 So, all of them are the right answer. But I'm sure that, depending on what I choose in here, we go a different route with this interaction. Um, so what do you think it was? What made our ancestors destroy themselves? And what will prevent us from developing the same political problems? Interesting. Funny, that's exactly what the mayor said. But you're right. If it's possible to learn from the mistakes of our ancestors, that means history doesn't have to repeat itself. Exactly, my friend. Thanks for talking to me, 1K. You're welcome. I know we're in the middle of something, but I kind of needed that. Good. He's on uh, our side. Let's put it again. Okay, let's go. Well now, we have the droplets. Remember that thing with the gravity? Mm-hmm. Watch out, you don't want to melt or something. Oh, it looks a lot like a gate, but it ain't. Ah, we found the gate. Looks like another set of puzzles. Yep. Same pattern, one gate, three receivers. Like some sort of fractal symmetry. So red. Honestly, red. Um, so there's a bridge in there with the gate. There's a bridge in there. And there's this bridge in here with the gate. Oh, he's going with his drone. But in there I see only the red. Maybe there is green in there and blue in there because I see blue down there, I see green down there. There is a lot of red up top. Uh, so this must be the red side of it. Come on, show us what you got in there. Uh, okay, can I d do something here? Yes, I can. Uh, so what do we have? Um, let's do like this, like that, and like that. Okay, so apparently these guys don't need activate free beams. Oh, we gotta, oh, they're in there. So, blue? Where is that thing flying? I don't see it anyway. I was able to hear it, but 
Uh, okay, let's go clockwise. So blue. Okay. Archie's getting locked out of parts of the system. I think I've tracked down some more schematics though. Let's see. Uh, this this might do something work. or not. Um, like that. Like that. I like that. Good stuff to me there. Okay, this is a little more creepy than it was out there in the open, you know? I see that blue laser in there. Where exactly is this one taking me? Um, very See green in there. Oh, I thought like this are like pedestals. You gotta spin them. So green. He's flying that shit on there. So we need red and blue, but we don't have blue anywhere. Oh, we get the red in there. Sorry. Uh, stay here. So yeah, this doesn't change. Oh, we get red in there. Let's go back. Ah, the red doesn't pass us. Shit, wasn't paying attention. Sorry. Does it now? Yes, it does. Perfect. So we need the blue on that one. Perfect. Uh, in there. From here. Okay, it opened up the way up. In here. Oh my god, this place is so beautiful. But creepy at the same time, you know? Uh, I mean, this one looks like Maya combined with technology, okay? And we're gonna put something like this in it. It's okay, we get Star Wars, Star Trek in here, Magic A. Combined with Maya, I mean, really? How do I activate this boy? I see the power cam on here. Speaking to the microphone, magic. Good job, 1K. Really? What's down there? Oh my god, amazing. Looking at the recording time, I see that we are more than one hour in. So I think we're gonna stop in here, guys. 
So into the next one I'll have to take care of the green which is there and the red which is up there. Oh, I think that one can be accessed through the green. Like go in there, make the green. What are the those noises in here? Uh, make the green happen. Is that gun in there apparently? And then we gotta somehow cut it through there, go up there, and take care of the green. I don't know where the green gun is, but uh, red I said. Oh, it's in the the red gun. And then uh, continue that way, you know. Oh, looks like it's kind of imprisoned in there. That's an advanced robot, like us. Why did you have to go and put this kind of stupid noises in this game? This is not about hunting and being afraid here. It is what it is. Guys, we're gonna leave this one here. Oh, look, beautiful mushrooms. Thank you so much for being here for watching this. If you like it, don't forget to push the like button for me, okay? Subscribe if you wanna see more. And if you wanna help me, of course. And if you want to support my dream of becoming a full-time content creator, you can do that by grabbing yourself an amazing membership. Thank you. I'll see you in the next one. Take care of you all.